Yo YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to make a 2D logo into 3D. So first you need the logo you want. For this video we're going to use my own website logo. I'm going to show it to you. It's this one. Next you want to go to your browser and go to picsvg.com. This website. You're going to click upload the picture. Choose the logo you want to make 3D. We want this one. It's going to convert it into an SVG, like you can see. It only makes the outline of the logo and the uh, letters. So you click on Download SVG. Make sure you have downloaded it. Next, you want to go to Fusion 360 over here. We're going to go to Insert, Insert SVG. Insert for my computer. Select the file we just downloaded. So this one. Then you have to select the, the view, the top plane view. This one. So as you can see, we have the logo here now, but it's nowhere near 3D. It's only uh, it's flat. It's only a 2D logo. With this, you can drag it around, turn it around, scale it. For the video, we're going to scale it a bit. Turn it in the middle. Something like this. And you're going to click Finish Sketch. You have to wait a second. So, here it is. It's the outline. As you can see, the letters has outline on it too. And it's nowhere near 3D. So, next you want to go to Extrude. Select. Click here. Then hold the Select key. And just click all those faces. Here with the letters, you don't want the outlines, you just want the letters. So still hold shift and click them all. Give me a second. And this one, and two more. That's it. And now you have you can see we have a little arrow here you can drag it upwards and it will extrude the entire logo or over here you can type in how big you want it uh, for the video we do like five and press enter as you can see it's already 3d that's how easy it is to make a, la a logo into 3d but just for the video, I had a black background and if you want to make it a sign or something or a business card, we got to make the entire logo. So we're going to click on create sketch, click the top plane view. Then we're going to go to this one, two point rectangle, because we need a background for it. Let's say something here. So, yeah. And click finish sketch like before it's still 2d so we're gonna extrude it upwards click on extrude just click on the on the square we just made you can drag it upwards like this but the entire thing is going to disappear so we made the letters like five millimeters so i'm gonna do this one like two millimeters in this box you want to not select cut because it's going to cut the letters now you're going to select new body and press ok so we have something like this you can see we have a background now you can make this a sign or a business card uh, so we want to make this black you're going to click it right click it go to appearance open this menu you can pick all kinds of fabrics and stuff so um, I usually choose plastic for the background we want some black plastic so we drag this one to the background so the background is black now the logo was gold as you can see I'm gonna show it one more time you can see the logo it's black and gold so you want to go to gold, I already selected it, but it's under metal, then gold, 
and this one uh, what you can do is you can drag this one to here or you can just hold shift click on the edges of everything you want to make gold and drag and it's make them all gold now so we're gonna do the letters too zoom in a bit hold shift key click make sure you select the entire letter and this one Almost there. And so drag the gold one to one. And I'll turn them all into oh, I forgot the H. Click on the H and drag this thing there. When you're done, click close. And there you have it. A 3D logo made from a 2d logo just to make it more beautiful go to design click render and you can see the final uh, product like this so that's it if you have any questions ask them in the comments and i'll try to help you please hit that like and su subscribe button bye